latest news update from Western Mass News. I'm Paris Sunford. Here's your latest news update from Western Mass News. Governor Baker announced yesterday that he is activating more members of the Massachusetts National Guard to help out as the state's health care system has been hit hard by COVID-19 and the Omicron variant. Western Mass News checked in with local hospitals to see where this extra help is headed. Bay State Health says they have not received any word yet. And Governor Baker is also sending 26 million rapid at-home testing kits to communities across the state starting in the next 90 days, spreading shipments out through most of March. Baker is now pushing for these tests to be used over lab tests. Governor Baker says a positive rapid test does not need to be followed up with a PCR. And the Department of Public Health does not suggest employers require a negative COVID-19 test to return to work after isolation. And eight people are without a home following a fire on Van Ness Street in Springfield. The Springfield Fire Department tells Western Mass News the cause is believed to be an electrical malfunction, which started between the first and second floors. One firefighter did suffer non-life-threatening injuries. Dan? All right, Paris, thank you very much. Good morning, everybody. Hopefully your day is going smoothly. Not as frigid today. Cold start, but boy, the cold air is retreating quickly, and we're going to be back into the 30s this afternoon. So the Arctic cold retreats. We'll have a couple of seasonable, milder days, but the cold does return as we head into the weekend, particularly Friday night and on into Saturday. And we're watching two coastal lows, one for Friday that will most likely be a miss for us here in Western Mass and perhaps another threat here Sunday night into Monday. So for today, high pressure shifts offshore. We get more of a southwesterly flow. That'll bring temps up into the 30s. We're near 40 tomorrow, and then a wave of low pressure off the Carolina coast Friday will miss us to the east, but that will pull down another batch of Arctic cold for Friday night and as we go through your Saturday. But for today, temperatures are coming up. It'll be more comfortable once we get into the afternoon. We're in the mid-30s. Still a bit of a breeze, but wind chills in the 20s as opposed to below zero. So much more seasonable today. And for tomorrow, clouds, some sunshine mixed in. The wind is a little lighter. A nice day in general. High temperatures right around 40 degrees. That storm misses us on Friday, but it pulls down that Arctic air as we go into the weekend. All right, that's your forecast, everybody. Have a great Wednesday. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.